Hey Lisa, this is Paul with Grassfire. In this video, I'm gonna show you three things that you guys can do today to actually bring you guys some more business. Now you might be sitting there, why does the guy shoot me a video and what's in it for him? Oftentimes in the world of the internet, local business owners are just too busy to actually focus on their website and what they need to do because they're out there running their business. They're out there making their customers happy. And sometimes there's a, just a hesitation in not knowing who to hire to actually get your website actually ranking to um, its most potential in Google and actually bringing in customers off of it. So what we found is just shooting a quick video, giving you guys an attack plan on how you can uh, fix this issue, actually get your website working hard and making it a workhorse for you, bringing in new business, um, has resulted in business owners saying, hey Paul, uh, we don't have time to do this, we know it's important, but can you help us with this? And we'd love to talk to you about your business, how you guys are trying to grow, and see if we can help you get your business website uh, just running up into the rankings of Google and when people are searching for things. Now, if at the end of this video you like what you see and you'd like to talk further, just reach back out to me. I would love to, again, help you guys and, and see if we can grow your business in 2021. Or at the end of this video, if you're like, hey, thanks to the info, uh, we want to just do this ourselves, then that's fine by me too. At least you'll know what to do. Now, there are three things that your company can do to actually beat your competition. And I'm not going to waste any more time right now. I'm going to dive right into that. So the first thing I noticed is you guys don't have a secure website, and that is kind of a no-no in the world of the internet. Google uh, really looks down on ranking sites that, don't, are, that aren't secure. It's a vulnerability to your customers. Unfortunately, there's just a lot of bad people in the world who actually try to steal our information. So what we wanna do is get that fixed first thing, but that's not the three things that rank you guys and help you guys move up. So when I search commercial refrigeration, Springdale, Arkansas, uh, United Refrigeration, TWC Services, uh, Teague Heating and Air is pulling up in the organic section. AJ Restaurant Service, um, you've got some um, George's Heating and Air. Again, you, you guys are just not pulling up in this organic section until maybe way, way down in there. And you're not in this top three section. And this is just one specific example. It's not all that you guys do, I know. And we can look at that further um, when we do um, a more in-depth analysis of your business and uh, what you guys are, are trying to target. But uh, the, the thing that you're, we're trying to do is get you guys to rank high in this. And what Google wants to do and what they want to see is content on your page. So all of these words, all these images, they want to see 1,500 words of content on your page. You guys right now have uh, probably under 100 words of content. And uh, that content allows you to have enough words on the page enough graphics and such that we can put the keywords that Google is that, that are being searched in Google, like commercial refrigeration, Springdale, Arkansas. It could be heating and air, Springdale, Arkansas. It could be uh, heating and air, Northwest Arkansas. So there's a lot of different key terms that we can actually look at the volume on of how many searches those are. But we have to get that on your page and we have to get that uh, in a way that Google can actually crawl your site and pick up those key phrases, key terms, and pull those into their algorithm and start ranking you guys high. So that's the number one thing that you wanna do. The second thing that Google wants to see are citations. Citations are all of these directories that are on the internet that you can list your name, address, and business phone number in. That's your NAP. There's thousands of these, and we can look in this tool, and I've just got a, an example here of some roofing companies that I looked up of, of where your company would rank against your competition. And so what we do is we put your company in here, and say you guys had 26 of these directory listings. These are the Yelp, Better Business Bureau, Manta, Facebook, all of those types of online directories. Some of them are free, some of them are paid. We always target the free ones first. And uh, we look at what your competition's doing. Your, comp your competitors are over here in the 58, 65 range. You know, they've got twice as many as you guys. And so we look at what they have versus you, and on some of them, you're gonna have all the same. And then others, you know, you guys might be missing this one, you might be missing this one. So we go get that because your competition already has it and we match what your competition has as far as the quantity and then we go and add another 100 because what we're trying to do is we're trying to push you guys to the top and Google wants to see you guys at the top and when, you're, when you have the most of those directory uh, listings, it just tells Google like, hey, this is legit business. They, um, they're a part of being a, you know, the authority in their field in this area and um, we want to rank them higher so by adding an additional hundred on there allows us to rank you guys first and then put <clears throat> the other guys in second place always playing catch up to you guys and then we monitor that as they try to catch up we add some more as they catch up they add some more so that's how that works third thing that google looks for are these backlinks now i'm going to put you guys in this program called hrefs i've got your website in here and then 
I've got uh, Teague in here as well, one of your competitors. And I believe I've got uh, Pascal in here as well. So I know you guys all do work in Springdale. I know some of it's, uh, they're, you know, Pascal's a little bit more heavy on the residential side. But just an example of what's going on. So you guys have 42 backlinks, 12 referring domains, and 61 keywords. So these keywords is what's being pulled off of your website right now. And if I look into that, I will see uh, just what you guys are being found for. You guys do have air conditioning, Arkansas air conditioning and refrigeration on there. It gets searched 20 times, and you are in position one on that. So for that specific term, you're doing a pretty good job. Now, if you look at Arkansas air conditioning, uh, 40 times the search, uh, you're in position three. Again, doing a pretty good job. Now, let's drop down to like heating and air spring to Arkansas. There's 50 searches a month on that. You guys are in position 28. You've got heating and air Northwest Arkansas, 20 searches for that a month. You guys are in position 32. Uh, air conditioning, uh, HVAC, Springdale, Arkansas, 40 searches a month, 35. So what I'm seeing here is that although you have a couple of these uh, that you're doing pretty well, this one's actually dropped two positions, so you might we might need to see what your competition is doing for that one. But there are a lot of opportunities here for you guys to actually pick up a lot of search. And when you pick up website search, you're not trying to get all of it. You're trying to get a percentage of that. And when you're ranked number one, you can get more of that percentage. And those customers contact you first. You guys get to close the sale and actually turn them into a paying customer. We look at like, you know, where's the three or four or 500 volume of search? Maybe it's over different uh, key phrases. And we go pick those up and actually we actually optimize your website to actually pick up that search volume. And that's how that turns into actual uh, dollars for you guys. Now look at your competition. They have, um, you know, Teague's got 35. Heating and Air Springdale, Arkansas, he's in position 15. HVAC Springdale, Arkansas, 28. You know, they can do the same. They've got the same thing to do on that. Um, if you look at uh, Pascal, they've got 181 organic keywords. Of course, a lot of them have their name in it, but then HVAC Springdale, they're really targeting this one. 40, and they're in position four. You've got uh, air conditioning and repair, Northwest Arkansas, 10 searches, they're in position four. Heating and air, Fayetteville, 60 searches a month, position 11. So as you can see, there's just a lot of search uh, on a lot of these different terms. Now let's look at backlinks real quick. So the backlinks are all of these interconnected web pages. So website A refers to website B. And there's a link there and Google looks at that and says, hey, they're legitimate, it's a legitimate link and I'm gonna give that a little bit of juice. So if you guys have a Pizza Hut you guys did, did some work for and they link on your website saying thank you, use these guys or whatever. And that link creates a, a, a little bit of juice in Google's eyes. But they know you guys aren't slinging pizzas for a living so it's just in a different industry even though you did the work for them. Now, if you have a trade a magazine or an online magazine or something like that where they're doing a blog post or it's a trade association or a general contractor links to you guys' website, then Google looks at that and says, hey, that's a legitimate link and we will um, give you guys a lot of link juice on that. So let's look at the different amounts of juice that you're getting right now. So you've got a couple here, yellow dot plays, home improvements quotes that are giving you a couple, you know, a little bit of juice off of their uh, link. So let's look at Pasco and see what links they have and how much juice they're getting for just to compare. So that you've got two right here with 66. So ream.com is linking to them and easylocal.com is linking to them. Uh, and, and so what this tells me is that even though they've got a whole lot more links, there is some with some, some strength here. And what we want to do is go get the same links that they, can, they have if, if possible. And that boosts you guys up to this equal level of them. And then you add on top of that uh, more and more backlinks that actually bring you guys some strength. And that's how you beat these guys. So, so just in review, the top three things that you're looking for to get outrank your competition and really beat them online is content is king, 1,500 words minimum, um, you know, specifically targeting cer certain search terms. We've got backlinks. We have to do what your competition is doing. Go get those same links for you guys so we can match them and then they go above and beyond them and push more and more juice, more and more power to your site. Third thing are those citations. Get your business listed in as many directories as possible. Uh, above your competition and boost you guys to the top. Google will search and crawl your site over time and start moving you guys up in the ranking and that's where you want to be. Um, if we can help you further, I would love to talk to you about your business and help you guys really get your website working hard for you. My name is Paul with Grassfire again. You can reach me at 479-326-7899. Thank you.